I want to bring in someone who has helped organize today's protests. M. Adams is an organizer and spokesperson with the Young, Gifted, and Black Coalition. M. There has been some significant differences in how Madison's police chief has handled this compared with what we saw in Ferguson. You heard Chief Mike Koval say he's sorry. He has released the name of the officer, even revealed a previous police shooting that this officer had been involved with uh, back in 2007. The officer was cleared in that case. And the chief also declined to say whether Tony Robinson has a criminal record. We now know he does. He pleaded guilty to an armed robbery just a few months ago. So, M, what do you make of the police chief's response to all this? I think the only difference that actually is going to matter here that's going to make us different than Ferguson, New York and other places is whether or not this police officer is going to have to face justice. If the officer is arrested and then convicted, then we can say Madison police is better or different. But just uh, giving niceties is not enough for a community that is grieving over the loss of a child, an unarmed child. What makes you so sure that the